Thou who art God's child, yet yearn to become king of pandemonium. Discard thy humanity, thou or da 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 blah 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 blah. Unite with me. No, I don't want to unite with you. Oh my god. He created a dimensional uh, shift. Bebbles, so this is the king's gate. <laughs> the king of bells, a grandmaster, destroyer, one who makes all things shudder. Now receive my power to feed me and absorb my dormant power then into my thy body. Whatever. Take it. I looks like I go again before uh, that babble dude, which is gonna be nice. If I move, it's, it's gonna cost. I don't want to move right now. K scale, on the other hand, might be able to. Oh, this dude's weak against lightning, eh? This dude reflects everything but lightning. Wow, case case. That's kind of nonsensical. Oh my god, looks like we should be doing something. Um, at zero, we're gonna heal at zero, and then we're gonna move up and attack. Thankfully, our move turn doesn't even cost that much. When we move, we don't even cost that much because we have Phantasma. Oh, uh, 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 uh. I like this music. Makes me go, uh. <laughs> we get a Deathbound, and Ukano is probably just going to... We're just going to have your boy guard. 193, that's it. Oh my god, he did plenty of damage to him. Even with Mazio, it's like, this dude doesn't seem to take a lot of damage. I got rid of his extra turn though, which is really good. So, I'm actually just going to heal Keisuke. I should've just drained. Uh, we're gonna do nothing. That Zero is gonna walk up and probably get bopped. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm actually gonna switch out Komoku. I'm actually gonna give Komoku to your boy Lion. Yeah, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. That's for a good cause. Bringing in your boy, Catopolis. So now what we're going to do is actually suspend our data. Lion's going to be able to double up on his third turn. Oh my god, this dude has a lot of fucking health. So we're probably going to multi-strike here. We're going to Deathbound, and we're just going to attack. This dude has nothing but Almighty, so Shield All is useless. So we might as well just go all out. Put them lumps. Oh, we can't put lumps on this guy. We can put dents into him, though. Oh my god. He gets another turn because of that, too. Wow, that was kind of devastating. <laughs> So if I move up to Shiva, what I can do, I can awaken. And then I can attack. Oh my god, this dude is a problem. This dude's level 77. Holy dance. I have Pierce, so it's not really gonna matter, but. I should holy dance to take advantage of the uh, awakening. Let's see if we can Giga Jama this guy. Nope. He lost his extra turn, which is really good. Damn, man. This dude's got some high ass resistance. Maybe I should do nothing for now. I should preserve my MP. No, I'm actually going to heal within this fight. And you know what I'm going to do now? I'm actually going to... Once again, I'm going to Deathbound. And I'm going to... I'm going to Deathbound with your boy as well, Astaroth. 
Oh wow, he tried to activate it again. Alright, the reason why I opted out for less damage and for another, uh, for the, the, the actually heal was to, to pretty much prevent my turn from going too high up. Because I could have easily healed outside of battle, right? But I didn't want to do that because it was going to make my turn cost go up. Wow. Holding to prayer. Mane is going to... Well, Atsura is pretty much dead, so I should probably just... Just wait it out. I'm probably just gonna wait that out. Oh my goodness, the sniffles. Um, Mazio, so we can get rid of his damn extra turn. And he's faster than us, apparently. He's faster than your boy. So we have Pierce. Probably gonna Deathbound. I'm going to Dairahan. Taise. Taise. Get rid of that extra turn. Good stuff. That Reflect is putting in work. So we're gonna Drain, and then we're gonna Deathbound again. Good stuff. Dude, Pierce is really helping out for this fight. Like, real talk. So we are probably going to heal Keisuke, because he's like the main priority right here. Keisuke has been putting in work. No matter what anybody says, he's been putting in some of the... Uh, I want to say... Oh, he, he would go for your girl, Amane. Good thing she has Fortify to help out here a little bit. Alright, Fortify for the win. Amane's still good. She's still good. And then guess what? She has revive anyway. Oh my god. He got an extra turn. He had an extra turn. What a scumbag. Hellfire Gate. And then he gets the attack. Oh wow. That's such scumish. Why does he get all this? Wow. What? Why was he able to do all that, yo? Why was he able to do all that? That was that was fucking uncalled for, yo. He better not be able to move for like the next three fucking turns. That's all I gotta say. This dude got plenty of shit off. We're gonna try to, you know what, we, we are going to attack this guy. We are going to attack. Lion's going to guard. Lion's definitely gonna guard. He has no choice but to guard. We're going to deathbound because, well, of course. And he's gonna Giga Jama. Alright, that doesn't work. Get shit. That fucking dual shadow. That fucking dual shadow, yo. I'm going to attack anyway. Fuck him. Nine damage? It's gonna help out in the end. That little scumbag ass motherfucker. I'm so mad at that. But Amane's right next to me, so. Amane's actually going to. Revive Shiva immediately. He's the guy doing most of the damage. I think your boy is going to recall. Oh, yeah, I don't have recurring on them no more. Well, anyway, Keisuke, um, Keisuke needs to be healed. And then in battle, what I'm going to do? Is dual shadow. Not dual shadow, but I'm going to physically attack this dude. I really need to get past his defense. Hopefully. I'll just guard with him. Deathbound. Hopefully he doesn't go before Taisei there. And we're just gonna have him guard. This stuff. 
Alright, we gotta do as much damage as possible right there. Still killed his ass, huh? Guard. Attack. 111. Gotta do as much damage as we can, yo. Wow, he, he chose, he opted out to attack. Wow, that was probably the biggest mistake you could do right there. Um, at zero, we're just gonna have you just end your turn, dude. Amani is actually going to bring back. Dude, this dude's been helping get his HMP back. Because he did all that shit, he goes super slow, and we should be able to kill him before he gets another turn. So yeah, Amani's not gonna do anything. She's just gonna end her turn so she can revive everybody else. So yeah, end your turn. Well, you might have... Nah, we're not, we're not gonna have him do anything. So we're going to have Amane again, revive somebody else. Yeah, this guy's probably very useful, so yeah. He's gonna be able to heal. He's going to be able to use him to heal next turn, so check it out. Kisuke recovered too. So now what we're going to do is have your boy heal Taisei so he can deathbound and possibly even kill this guy on the next go. So... So we're going to attack. Um, Kisuke is going to guard. He has to guard. Because if he takes any damage, he's dead, and that's the end of it. So, guard, death bound, and your boy's gonna heal him. Got damage, and he missed. Alright, we in there. We still in there. We still. Oh my god, we ain't in there. Um. Fuck it. Holy dance him. Holy dance him. Ukano, you got it. You got it. Clutch it. You didn't clutch it. But it's alright, because we resist fire. Well, it's up to your boy Lion. Will Lion be able to clutch it? Find out on the next episode of Devil Survivor Over. Nah, fuck it. We might as well just go do it right now. I ain't playing games either. Awakening. <laughs> Awakening. Skills are sealed, but you know what? It doesn't really matter. We're gonna have your boy guard, and he's gonna holy dance because of Awakening. I do, of course, maybe we should just death bow. All right, that's good. Uh, uh, uh. Get out of here! You're still alive. Thank you. <laughs> Dude was trying to survive so hard. He was trying to survive so hard. That better be the end. I have indeed seen the power! Who art God's child, yet holds the power of Bell? <laughs> Thou art truly my master. I shall present all my power to the new overlord of Bell. Yes. The new king of Bell. We did it. We did it! And all my main characters survived. Good stuff. Damn. Oh, I tried to show you the bottom screen. Oh my god, what is that? Did we... win? We... we won. We, we pulled through. We did it. Is it over? It is over, right? Remiel told me a moment ago, all the powers of Bell have gathered into him. Oh yeah. Rather, into God's child, Abel. And the war for the throne of Bell has come to an end. And lo, a king is born. Oh, uh, so everything's good. Is the final option called off? What about the lockdown? There is no need to worry. Remiel has sworn upon his own name and on God's to lift the lockdown and restore peace. Are you sure we can trust him? The angels may neither deceive nor lie. Their words are unvarnished truth. Dad! We did it! It's over. 
He can finally rest in peace now. Nice, we ended the lockdown. We did it! They're finally gonna lift the lockdown! I think that was the main entire goal we all wanted was just to lift the lockdown. We really did it! I feel like all my fatigue has just... poof! Yeah! Not only that, but he's an overlord now! I, I mean, a messiah! Overlord <laughs> and messiah. Y yeah What's wrong? Oh, um, it's nothing. It's just... He still looks normal, but he's not really human anymore. I'm sorry. I had no right to say that. You have a huge responsibility ahead. Don't worry about it. I hope you'll stay with me. Let's see. I hope you stay with me. Oh my god. Uh, yes, uh, of course I will. Of course, because the Messiah has to be a mag daddy. <laughs> I'm glad you're still the guy we know, no matter how powerful you get. I believe in you. That you're gonna be okay. I'm right there with you. We only got this far because we put our trust in him. I wish I could take his place, but I know I can't carry such a heavy burden. So I figured the least I could do is follow him with a smile. <laughs> Soro. Jeez. That was kind of cool. For you, I mean. Damn. What do you mean, for you? <laughs> Figures. Same old you who. You little... Don't call me you who Oh, here they go again. Oh, here it goes. I'm glad I came with you. We're about to enter a truly just world. Well done. God's desires have been met. The King of Demons will kneel before the Lord, and his power will be used for order. I didn't do it for the Lord. I did it for myself. I just wanted to know how it feels to be Messiah. It feels, it feels great, goddammit. <laughs> A world of total order, free of all sin and chaos, will surely begin. Attention citizens! A temporary order lifting the lockdown has been issued. It will be enacted shortly. Everybody's about to get hyped. Specific directions to follow. Please stay calm and await further notice. We thank you all for your patient cooperation. I repeat. <laughs> Lockdown's over, huh? Looks like it's back to Dullesville. Those kids really did it. <laughs> well, how about that? They've done it. Speaking frankly, no mission has ever been this painful for me. Indeed. And it isn't over just yet. People are leaving seven days of danger and confinement. If we mishandle this, another panic could start. Our job has just begun. Yes, sir. But this mission, it doesn't involve demons, correct? <laughs> <laughs> then sign me up as your first volunteer. Scarred by the demons. That sounds like a good song. Soon afterward, the Tokyo lockdown that lasted seven days was finally lifted. Though only a few knew the truth, people could sense that the malicious presences had disappeared and they started rocking out to this riff. Those who survived were grateful to be alive and mourned for those who were less fortunate. A new form of order came over this world. What the hell? I got a cape? That's so cool. The young new king of Bell. Who held the power of demons. Was urged to use that power. As God's advocate. I got a cape. I got a cape. To be the absolute judge of man's sins. Thus would man always live with the fear of God and live pure lives at all time. A new age of law had come to the world. Bruh, look at my cape. Sometime after the incident, You receive an email, your altered comp, 
whose role in the events has already ended. You who are son of man, yet became king of pandemonium. Well done on your victory in the ordeal. Now that you are an overlord who kneels before the Lord, this world shall be filled with his authority. His authority as a place of order. Y'all better step in line. <laughs> All lies, doubts, and disloyalty shall be judged accordingly. Boo, 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 boo. I shall be watching you in your capacity as his loyal servant. Damn, yeah, man. I just wanted to know how Messiah felt like. I'm still chilling in the crib playing games, recording YouTube videos. I'm the Messiah. I'm supposed to be doing all this other stuff. But apparently we just beat the seventh day, but on the back of the game's case it says there's an eighth day. So obviously there's more, so I'm not even gonna talk. I'm not even gonna get my thoughts on the game, but all I know is that was pretty interesting, and I'm probably gonna play like a lot of this stuff off camera, like the other pathways and stuff off camera, because there was a lot of things that were interesting. I was hella interested in uh, Haru's path, or not Haru's, but Jin's, or Gin's path. And I'm probably gonna check that out off camera. I'm probably not gonna record that. But a lot of these games' pathways, the, the interesting, the stories are just so interesting. All of them. There's no. I don't think there's one best story. There's no best ending to me. There's just another ending, another in another ending, another ending. If you enjoy this, you enjoy that, you enjoy this. There's no best ending. In my opinion, there is no best ending. It just it just falls upon your personal taste on how you want it to end. It comes down to your personal choice on which one's your favorite. Not there's no best choice, dude. Like you can like the law ending, but you can end up hating the neutral ending. And you might be like, you know, the chaos ending was alright, but I still like the law ones better. You know what I'm saying? There's no best ending. And that's pretty cool for these kind of games. I like games like that. But I also like games that have a definitive ending. You know, a canon ending. But right now, we're just gonna sit back and listen to the damn music and get ready for the 8th day prompt. Because we all know I'm not dumb. I know there's an 8th day. Like, I'm not dumb. I've read everything about this game on the back of the case. The brand new 8th day. So we're just gonna chill, and we're just gonna wait for that prompt. I met you, Namda, at EVO. That guy was pretty chill. He was pretty chill. Really, He was a really cool guy. Dicka, 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 dicka.
Oh my god, the credits are finally done! Yes! Conquer your demon! Break your barriers! Enter the world of Sword Art Online! What? Let's survive! S-A-O! What is this? Kirito's dual wielding! There's a lot of waifus! Metatron can now be fused using the Cathedral of Shadows. You can either save your clear game data or create a save to continue playing on the 8th day. Clear data lets you transfer or transfer your demon compendium and unlock fusion details to a new gang. You will also be shown the survival awards menu before starting your next round. The points you gain by earning titles can be spent on rewards that will affect the gang. Cool. So it's like new game plus from Tales of. That's cool. 8th day data lets you continue playing on your next Playing on your route into the next day. We're gonna create eighth day data. Eighth day data. And we're gonna create it for this. All right, eighth day data. And then guess who showed up at the time? Amane. We filled her out. She shows up now. That's pretty cool. So can I also create some other data? All right, so. We are now about to move on to the 8th day, but we're not going to do it yet. I'm actually just going to pretty much call it a day. I wanted to record at least one more episode of the 8th day, but unfortunately, I got people waiting on me at a specific place, so I need to go get this done. Um, the 8th day will definitely beat the 8th day, hopefully before the next Devil Survivor game comes out. If you haven't noticed the change in the banner, obviously I'm playing the next one. The, re the, re uh, the original reason why I started playing Devil Survivor Overclocked in the first place was to prepare myself for a break record. So I was like, you know what? Devil Survivor intrigued me when I first saw it like about two years ago, but I never played it. But I finally got to play it and it's really good and I can't wait to play the second one. So we're going to try to beat this 8th day uh, route before uh, single day mile, which is when the game actually gets released. So we're definitely going to try to beat this eighth day before next week. And I will see you guys most likely next week, Wednesday, or this week coming up for the, you know, the eighth day of Amane's route. So I'll see you guys later.